immigrant workers. Yeah, okay, they got a loan to pay their minions, so you know what that means? They took our job. They took our job. They took your job. Wait a minute. I thought we were mad because of their gender choice and sexuality and stuff. No, that's all those other guys. We just want our jobs back. Oh, well, let's get your jobs and make fun of them for their former self-identification. Wow. America in a nutshell. Sorry, tougher nigga. You gotta go. Uh, yes. Pimp strength. Hmm. What? Oh, I didn't see that. Come on, boys. Let's show them some minions made in America. Speaking of minions. <laughs> oh, I play as him. Okay. I thought he was going to control himself. I'm going to bounce your ass like my chicks. And Shadow Clone. Magic, bitch. This mean I get to go back on disability? Hallelujah. America was built by America, not fucking minions. Microaggression. Hit him. <laughs> That's what I was telling you about. When I was trying to get you to go to the fast point. But you kept doing other stuff. So. I will run you down if you don't fucking move. It's been so long since that's happened. Clear. I forgot America. all about the shit like Love that. It or your ass kicked, socialist. Okay. Huh. I, I only work here. That works. All right, ready to make some weather? That was not enough. You nasty. I'm not gonna reach that move and damn it. Gee whiz, that must have hurt bad. It's time. Suicide bomber. <laughs> <laughs> Well, gosh, I feel 
bad I don't have enough minion jobs for those fellers. But thanks again, new kid. Who knows? Maybe we'll start our own Legion of Evil super villains one day. That'd be pretty sweet, huh? Bye! They really made that an option. I'll probably do it. Let's see what it'd be like playing as the bad guy. Horns of the deplorable. Well, actually, he doesn't have a kryptonite anymore because he's ungroundable after that last mission. First time I've seen a car in here. I thought we had a friendship built on mutual respect and not farting on one another. I'm the fat. Fastest kitty? Uh, awesome! <sighs> See you, new kid. No, Sonanda! You dishonorable coward! Finds its prey. Ah, a storm front is brewing. Who wants a popsicle? Fire begins. This is my time. Here we go. Ah, Chinchado, stay in there. How the hell are you bleeding? Oh, oh that's right. Chaos is on the rise. Get him! Okay, 250 for cement work, 350 for murder. Es mi turno? I ain't never gonna get rid of that. <laughs> the fact that he busts his face. Oh boy, superheroes are so fun. I'm about sick of that nigga. <laughs> he don't never do nothing useful. You know what the biggest plot twist of the game will be? He actually do something useful, and it saves our ass. <laughs> that would be the biggest plot twist I would never see coming. Nice one. Ninja action, Junbi. Oh, I bring that. The weather is about to turn. That's a water bender. <laughs> Make it rain on these hoes. <laughs> I'm not your worst nightmare. I aspire to be. Fuck you, I had dolphin, bitch. 
How are you gonna have dolphins with no hey, water? Wanna see my hammer of chaos? Pretty neat. Es mucho más seguro ser un seguidor. You. Se trata de una especie de división. I missed half of what he said. Mm. Yay, Master Shinobi Slapper. Give it. Oh, how much you wait to buy Assassin's Creed to like after Black Friday? <laughs> if it's still there. It is not, no. I, I still got my Xbox 360. I'm talking about after Black Friday? You know that's where people are going get the real shit. Damn, I need to start selling some stuff because that's a lot of extra junk I don't need. Wait. Oh damn. I wanted to go look at that game. Where is everybody? Normally these bitches be out here crying and shit. Don't worry, baby. When I'm dead, the pain will all go away. <laughs> so that means you should be getting the pot by. Oh, I can't even go in. I thought I was gonna be able to look in the keyhole. I oh, fuck it. <laughs> the hell was that? You know what the hell I'm talking about, bitch. Did you do that on purpose? <laughs> Fix it. <laughs> no, girls. Allowed. Here's Butt Lord now. Great job, hero. Those freedom posters. No idea you fucked them over. All right, guys, listen up. But Lord nah, has discovered that the bullshit. Freedom Pals are infiltrating I the police station tonight. We have to get there the before switch. they do. The Rip police the station? We can't take down the police. Are you crazy? Yeah, just let the Freedom Pals go do it. We can't do that, guys. Why not? Because at approximately 10:30 a.m. this morning, Classy was arrested by the police. How do you know? Yo, what the fuck? You came where little bitch and said you protect my ass. They only give me one motherfucking phone call. So y'all niggas better come and get me the fuck out of here. Lame ass superhero wannabe motherfuckers. Oh, shit. We have to help her, fellas. We made a promise. If we let Freedom Pals go do this on their own, then we're the douchebag franchise they say we are. But why would Freedom Pals work with us? <laughs> Don't forget the new kid is all buddy-buddy with Freedom Pals now. But Lord can trick them into an assault on the lower level of the police station, and meanwhile we'll sneak in and bust Classy out. We're probably gonna get the Freedom Pals killed. And then, whose superhero franchise would be number one? We can't make a promise to Classy. Everyone get home and get to bed. We have a big job to do tonight. <laughs> That'll be all, Butt Lord. Go home and wait to hear from the Freedom Pass. No, oh, yes. What? What do you want now? You know what time what? it is. Again with the puppy eyes. Are you fucking kidding me right now? No, new kid, absolutely not. You cannot have another class. <laughs> Look, I'm sorry about what happened to your mother. <laughs> I know that you want closure, but... No. Oh. No, I guess I don't know how it feels. You're right. You're right. Maybe you should have just one more class. Perhaps a plant mancer, like Poison Ivy, or Groot. You were laying in bed and you heard your mom scream. You walked out into the hallway. Oh, he fast forwarded through all that shit. <laughs> what do you think of this, space boy? <laughs> As a plant mancer hero, you harness the powers of nature to protect, but also to attack. You couldn't stand to watch that innocent alien get bullied. It was time to give those thugs a taste of their own medicine. You conjured a sweet smelling scent to charm one of the intruders. Wow, you smell like flowers. I'll do anything for you. Completely enamored. The intruder was at the mercy of your will. This guy bothering you? Hey, what are you doing? Take this! Oh, 
Jesus. How could you fight a child? I love his stance. <laughs> that little nigga ready. <laughs> the blow from his comrade shook off your charm spell, but the confusion had bought the alien some time to recompose itself. She took out its space ray and opened fire on one of its attackers. You and the alien shared a glance. You could tell it trusted you. She reached to the ground so as to use Mother Nature's power to defeat the alien's attackers. Roots sprung from the ground, dropping the alien's bodies to the ground in a twisted wave of wood. Dope. Jesus, I'm out of here. Yeah, fuck your plants, kid. <laughs> your newfound alien friend breathed a sigh of relief. Move. But then a third intruder entered the hallway. Move. And he also he wanted to beat him. up the alien, so he did. With a vengeance. Move, move, move. The alien couldn't take the beating sitting down, of course. It retaliated with another shot of its face ray. You can see the alien was fighting for dear life, so you summon the gentler side of your plant powers to heal it. <laughs> move, move, move. But it wasn't enough. The intruder mercilessly continued to pummel your new space friend until it was unconscious. Move, move. Watching the alien fall sprouted something inside of you. You summoned all of your plant master power to revive your fallen friend. Mother Nature heard your call and bestowed her bountiful gifts upon you and the alien. Yeah. That is terrible. Move, move, move. As is the nature of a support class, the glory of the final blow rarely falls on you. Move, move. But you're always on the winning side. You ran to your parents' door, and before anything bad could happen, you ran inside to protect your mom. But you were too late. Your dad totally fucked her. Oh, I'm must be tearing you apart inside. How people can do that to other people, I just—I'm I'm so sorry. Anyway, we've got work to do tonight. I'll see you at the police station. There's nothing more to talk about. I'll be in touch tonight after your parents think you're sleeping. No. No. You really want to talk to me, huh? That sucks for both of us. Why? Well, at least I didn't wear the outfit too.